returning thank you for coming back to go to panera because i've been craving that cinnamon crunch bagel with the honey walnut cream cheese yeah been craving that since last night so i'm about to go there and i guess while i'm there i might as well just eat there and i'm gonna work on editing a video i feel like i might as well just get it but i also want some chipotle too y'all like this is really big of me so i don't know like i want some chipotle too I don't know what to do. I wish I would have got up earlier. That way, right now, I'll probably be hungry again. And then I can get Chipotle. But, I don't know. So, I'm going to get my bagel. Y'all heard the dogs. I kicked them out so I can record. Because, otherwise, they would just be all up running around how they usually do. But, yeah. So, we're just going to go to Panera. Actually, let me stop calling it Panera. Because it's not freaking called Panera. It's called Bread Co. Actually, it's called St. Louis Bread Co. If y'all didn't know, it's originated here. It's not called Panera. It's called Bread Co. So, let me stick to what I know. But, yeah. Really, I don't have anything to do today. I work overnight tonight, so I go in at 7. And it's 11 o'clock now, so I basically got the whole day. So, why not film and stuff? Because, like I said, we consistent all 2024. I know the year just started and that's, you know, typical for me to say. But, I mean it this time. Seriously. If y'all haven't notice by now i'm like back to back with the videos i'm gonna keep coming for y'all but while i'm talking don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and follow me on instagram at ny 4 es and the underscore tiktok at nyexny it'd be hard for me to keep up i put it on the screen somewhere over here i made a spam account not, I wouldn't really call it a spam. I guess you call it a spam. I don't know. But I made an account for strictly for like YouTube just for me to promote and connect with y'all on there versus my page. Like I can follow my personal page too. But this page is going to be, you know, just all things YouTube. So I made it or whatever. And the ad name is at nyce.jpg. So... I'm starting to be more active on there. Like, I'm going to talk to y'all and ask y'all, like, feedback on videos. What kind of videos y'all want. Just, you know, we can talk. And, yeah, I might go live on there because, if y'all don't know, I'm scared to go live on Instagram. Like, it gives me so much anxiety because on live, like, if you mess up, you can't delete the video and start over. Like, they just saw you mess up. So, that just, like, really gives me so much anxiety. Like, ugh. I can't edit it. I can't do nothing. It's just live going. Like, what if I accidentally spit or a booger fell out of my nose? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah, on that page, I don't have that many followers. I only have 90 followers. So, I would feel more comfortable going live with 90 followers versus the 4,000 that I have on my personal page. So, yeah. So, if y'all want to go follow me on there so we can talk and chit-chat and stuff like that. Y'all, this year, mark my words, I'm hitting 10K on YouTube. That's my goal for this year. It was actually my goal for last year, but I wasn't really consistent last year. So, I can't even be mad that I didn't hit it. Like, I'm mad that I didn't hit it, but I'm mad at myself because I wasn't consistent. But I also had, like a lot going on last year. So, it was hard to be consistent. But I'm not going to make excuses for myself because, you know... I gotta own it. But this year, this year, 2024, we hitting 10K. And I mean that. Like, we're hitting 10K. And I'm hitting 10K on TikTok for sure. I'm already at 7K on there. So, that's gonna be a little easier um, than YouTube because I'm only at 5,000. So, I got 5K more to go on um, YouTube. 
like 3k ish on tiktok and then like i just said my personal page only got 4,000, so that's 6,000 more to go but anything is possible and yeah i'm gonna put in the work and see what we can do because we might get way further than 10k but i'm done rambling at the mouth and yeah i just need to put on some perfume i just let the dogs out so they're good um so yeah i'm about to put on some perfume and then we can head out the door and you ain't gonna have no problem, I take care of you And if you ever gave me your heart, I won't embarrass you Why he going through your phone, he miserable I don't know what you do to me Better think about your life insurance before you tell your friends that you threw with me Told the shit that can ruin me I bring your last out I send you money whenever you need, I send you cash out Don't feel good to be on that black lead Why you put me on that black lead Oh, the same baby hey y'all so it's the next day i'm so tired right now like i don't even think y'all understand how tired i am it's 10.04 last night i worked overnight so i worked from 7 p.m to 7 a.m this morning and i haven't been to sleep since tuesday night so i am running on over 24 hours what is he talking about okay so yeah i'm so tired i worked the overnight last night and i didn't take a nap before the overnight so i've literally been up for over 24 hours right now i am exhausted like last night's shift was like a shift from hell the lady that i was working with y'all she was combative as hell like she's on hospice or whatever so she's like end of life basically and she was just hella combative she fought me the whole night when i say beating my ass i mean beating my ass y'all like throwing picture frames like whatever you name it whooping my ass so that was a bit interesting and i'm just freaking tired but the show must go on and not to mention on the way home they text me asking me if i wanted to work again today i'm supposed to be off today i'm not supposed to go back to work until tomorrow i was like i'm just gonna use all of today to just rest sleep no they text me while i was on my way home from work this morning asking if i wanted to pick up a small four hour shift it's four hours and it was four minutes away from my house so i felt obligated to pick it up so i picked it up so i have to go to work later i'm so sleepy i don't have any time to sleep until tonight so yeah i'm looking forward to it right now i'm at european wax center um this is last minute um the person i usually go to didn't have any open or whatever so last resort so i'm gonna come here and then i have a nail appointment at 11 it's 10 o'clock now and i need to go to PetSmart and get break some food and then i have to go to work so i'm trying to run all these errands before work and then after i get off i'm gonna go home and then i'm going to see my man and lay up under my man and go to sleep so i can sleep good tonight skin to skin that's what i need but <laughs> yeah so i guess i will see y'all inside i'm not sure if i'm gonna record or not i've never recorded me getting the wax i don't think maybe once i don't know we'll see uh since 2020 really do you have a lot of subscribers uh i'm at almost 5,000. Oh, okay so. Good for you. Thank you. That's what's yeah. up. How long have you been doing this? I have been waxing for almost four years. Now. Okay. Yes. Do you like it? I do. Okay. I like waxing. There's 
you know, I get the people that make me not enjoy my job so much. Mm -hmm. But I feel like that's the only bad part is when you get yeah. like a stink but attitude that's person. Any, any and that, exactly. Any job that you deal with people, you're going to get those people. So, All right, ready? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you tell me when you're ready. Just go. Just do it? Okay. I'm never taking a break again. Yeah, don't do it. I um, have the, um, I got the mints for Christmas. The exfoliating ones? Uh -huh. Okay, okay, do you still have them? Yes. You do? Okay, so you can use that. Okay, um, should I use like a product or? So, that's up to you. you Hey y'all, I haven't picked up the camera in about a week because I haven't did anything. As I saw y'all last Thursday, I went to work and then I've just been working every day since. So now it's next Thursday when I last talked to y'all. So it's been a week and we running errands again today. I don't know, it seems like Thursday's been a day to run errands for me lately. But right now we're about to take Brex in to his grooming appointment. It was originally at 10 o'clock, but I was running behind because I had to do something to my head. So I was running behind, so I ended up rescheduling his appointment for 10.45. It's 10.22 now, but I figured I'd rather be early than late. And I just didn't want her waiting around because I knew I wasn't gonna get her for another 25 minutes. So I didn't want her just waiting for 25. So I just rescheduled it to 10.45. So I'm about to take him in there. And then it's a Home Goods right next door to Petco. So, this is my first time actually going to Petco. I've never been to Petco. I've been to Pet Smart. Actually, Brex has never been to like Petco or Pet Smart like for a groomer because we usually go to like a small business. But they told me that they couldn't get him in for another three months. And I put him on a schedule, but I can't wait three months for him to get a haircut because he can't even see out of his eyes. Like, look at him. He blending in with the seats, first of all. Second of all, like, his eyes are covered. He's getting matted and stuff. So, they finna have to shave him down, unfortunately. And I'm so sad about it because he about to look brand new. He about to look scary. I don't... I. If y'all follow me on Instagram, then y'all know back in, like, June or July, he had to get shaved down. And he looked scary. Like, he was, like, this big. His hair make him look bigger than what he is, I realized. But he gonna look so skinny and just so, uh, not like my baby. So, yeah. But he's gonna have to get shaved down. So, this is my first time coming to Pet Cold. So, we're gonna see how they do and how he does here. I've been told that he does good at the groomer, so... Fingers crossed that that's what he doing. He don't give these people a hard time. But like I said, it's a home goods right next to Petco. So I'm going to run in there and see if I can find him a new bed and like some clothes or something. Because he don't have any clothes that he can fit now. Um, I bought him a whole bunch of clothes when he was a puppy. Well, he's still kind of a puppy. But when I first got him and I got him like all small puppy stuff and not his regular size now that he's full grown so i'm gonna see if they got something for him and then we have to go be a freaking adult so we have to go get an oil change we have to go get um new windshield wipers and my headlight is out so i gotta go buy a bulb and i know i can get all that done while i'm getting the oil change but it's cheaper for me to just go to AutoZone and buy some new windshield wipers and a headlight and have my dad or my boyfriend whichever one i see first put them on versus paying for somebody to do it so yeah we gotta do that and then i need to go to ulta and pick up my cousin birthday gift i have some perfume and stuff so we just got a whole bunch of running around to do so i hope y'all ready to run around with me Don't be sniffing on me. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and just go in there, drop him off early so I can go ahead and get started on my day. Okay, I'm in Ulta right now. I can't talk too much because they're clearly playing music, so I don't want to get copyright. But this is the perfume that she wants, so I'm just waiting on somebody to come back here to help me. Um, the Da Vinci Irresistible. Oh snap, you have to take Yeah. Love that. <laughs> My favorite uh, perfume too. Which really? One? Um, I don't know. She just said one of them. It's a birthday gift, so. Can I smell them? Yeah. Okay. We used to have the testers out, but. I figured that's why it's not right yeah. there. So this is one that I have, and then you can also try this one. How much did your camera cost? Cause my um, was it was like seven hundred. Mm -hmm. I mean, I didn't buy mine. But. I didn't either. <laughs> uh uh. Oh my gosh! I would love to look. Hold my phone I would love to. Uh, I would tell you, I would love. You got this one? Yes. Okay. Wait, no, no, no. 
Yes, that is the one I got. This it's one smells so good. good. Yeah, this yeah. smells real good. You're like, hmm. Yeah, <laughs> let me try these first. Okay. <laughs> now, I have not spilled that one, so I don't know. I it's know, super dark, so it gives me oh Yeah. Usually when they darker, yeah. they be super strong for me. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, uh uh. <laughs> Okay, I need a lip pencil because I'm clearly almost out. But they don't have the chestnut over there at MAC. So I'm going to get probably NYX. But I'm trying to compare them and see which one is closer to the one that I like. It ain't on my lips no more. But yeah, y'all yeah, get the point. I don't know. I feel like this one probably. Which one is this? Brown? Espresso. Can y'all see? Yeah, I can barely see. But it's probably this one. And then I want to try this. Mm -hmm. And then I got that Javinci back there. Uh -huh. How long have you been doing it for? Mm, three years. Really? Yeah. Okay. How many followers you got? Uh, I'm almost I at mean, 5k I mean, subscribers. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, y'all, so it's 1.36 now. The groomer, the lady that was grooming Brax or whatever, she texted me and said that it was going to be more additional time. But it really wasn't no time because when I got there, she told me three hours when I dropped him off. And I dropped him off at like 10.30. It's 1.30 now, so that's three hours exactly. But she had texted me like an hour ago and was saying that she was going to need more time with Brad because he didn't like the blow dryer, I'm assuming. So she had to kennel dry him. Something, y'all. I don't know. I guess he was giving a lady a hard time. I ended up going to Chick-fil-A, as y'all saw, and just grabbed me something to eat. I was trying to hold off and wait until I got home because it's food there at home for me to eat. But when she said more time, I'm like, I got to eat something because I don't want to go home and then come back out here just to go back home. I was just like forget it end up going to chick-fil-a eating and literally probably five minutes after i got done eating she texted me and said that he was ready so i'm kind of glad that i didn't go home because i would have been running right back out the house so he's ready and i'm here now i'm about to go pick him up she said that my total should be 89 dollars so we shall see what it end up coming out to. I kind of want to run into Home Goods and see their pet uh, section real quick. I know dogs can go into Home Goods, but I feel like Brax is going to be like overwhelmed and his anxiety going to be through the roof since he'd already been in one setting that he don't know. Even though he going to be with me, but if he was doing a lot while he was getting groomed, I just feel like I don't even want to put him in a position to be uncomfortable or for his anxiety to be even higher than what it is so just gonna run into home goods by myself and then go next door and pick him up because they're literally next door to each other so that's probably what i'm about to do and now i'm gonna take my black ass home because yeah i have just spent so much money within the last three hours it's ridiculous like and i'm mad because i haven't spent it on myself like it's nothing fun that that is useful for me or that i would want to spend my money on so We'll talk about it later, but yeah, let's go. I told y'all they was right next door to each other. That's Home Goods, and then that's Petco. So, yeah, we got to go into Home Goods first. I found this. It's super cute. It says I love my human. It's a size medium, but I don't know if it's gonna fit him because, like I said, I've never bought him clothes with him being this size, so I hope it does. It's a medium. Um, yeah. Five 
Y'all, sit down. Sit. Him don't even look like him. Ugh. Him so short. I still love the baby though. I still love the baby though. Uh, uh, uh. Sit. Sit. Come here so I can put you on camera. I still love the baby though. Look at him. Oh, him so little now. Oops, he even clocked the head. Yeah, whose dog is this? Whose dog is this? <laughs> Okay, y'all, so as y'all can see, I'm back home. I've been home for a minute, just haven't picked up the camera. But I just wanted to hop on here real quick and show y'all what I got at Ulta, cause I don't know if y'all can hear me for real since the music was playing and stuff. But my cousin wanted this um, Javinci Irresistible for her birthday, so I got her that. And then myself, I got, is it NYX, is it NYX? I don't know what it is, but I got a lip pencil because as y'all can see in that clip that I showed y'all when I was in Ulta, my lip pencil is hanging on by a thread, baby. It's 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 almost time. So that lip pencil is from Mac, and it's the chestnut, and that's like my favorite, all-time favorite. And you know, Mac they got a little selection inside of Ulta, but they didn't have chestnut. So I ended up going with this. It was five dollars. It was like the closest one to chestnut. So we're gonna try this and see how I like it. You know, MAC lip liners are $25. This was only five, so if I like it, you know, I'd be saving myself a cool little $20. I got this right here, Elf Squeeze Me Lip Balm. It's $4, $4 I think, four or $5. Kinda small, not kinda, it is small, but it's $4. So I feel like this is worth $4. If y'all watch A Wilkie, her real name is like Alexis, I believe, but her YouTube and TikTok and Instagram and all that is A Wilkie. She's one of my favorite YouTubers, and I was watching one of her videos one time, like a while back. She had got this, and I said that I wanted to try it, but I always forget to look for it, and then I end up stumbling across it today. I got the, what is this, Honeydew? Yeah, this is the Honeydew one. They got like five different ones, I think. But I got Honeydew. I was going to get Honeydew and Strawberry. But I just wanted to get one to see how I like it. So, my lips still lined a little bit. So, I'm going to just put this on. Can y'all see that? I don't think y'all can really see it. But it's coming out green. So, hopefully, it's not like green green on my lips. Let's see. It actually smell like honeydew. I like the the consistency of it. It's not sticky and it's not too thick. I like it. Let's see how long it lasts though. I'm gonna keep y'all updated. I, it probably won't be until the next vlog, but I'm gonna keep y'all updated. But I like the way it feel on my lips. Let's see. Hold on. Do my lips look green? No, they don't look green. It really just look like a clear coat on my lips. So, yeah. I think this is cool. Just like moisturizing my lips when I don't have on lip liner or anything like that. I probably use this while I'm at work and stuff. Because when I'm at work, I don't do the whole lip liner and stuff like that. Because I work in healthcare. But, yeah, this would be cool to just, you know, moisturize my lips. So, Alexis girl you put me on thank you and so let me tell y'all about me going to get an oil change I was so irritated y'all because usually I go on Groupon and I get I buy the Groupon for my oil change because on Groupon the oil change only like $70 if I just pay out of pocket without getting the Groupon my oil change gonna be like $120 so I do the cheaper route of course so this morning I went online and I bought the Groupon because this is what I usually do. I've been doing this since like 2017. So I get to the place, they do all my stuff, boom, boom, boom. He checking me out and he like, oh, we don't take Groupon no more. What do you mean you don't take Groupon no more? Why are y'all still on Groupon if y'all don't take it? So he like, yeah, we don't take it. 
So, I'm going to have to pay for this oil change that's 120 And I already paid $70 for a Groupon that I can't even use. Oh, baby, please. As soon as I got in my car, I emailed Groupon. Baby, y'all got to cancel this. Refund me. Do something because I, I, it's, it's really no point in me having it. Like, I can't even give it to somebody because it's not like I bought the wrong one or something like that. They don't accept it at all. So, that means it's just $70 just going to waste. No, y'all got to run me that back. Absolutely, you have to run it back for me. You have to. You have to. And while I was there, I needed an engine filter and an air filter. It's been time for me to get one. They've been telling me like the last five times when I be going to get an oil change that I need one. I always say next time. So I end up getting one this time. Of course, they're bringing the cost me up. Y'all, child, my total was like $200. Annoyed. Annoyed. Very much annoyed because I went in thinking that I was only going to pay for my taxes on the oil change because I got a Groupon. Ugh, don't piss me off. So then I went there, and I was just so irritated. I ended up going to AutoZone, but I didn't record that because I was literally lost to telling that story because I'm just a girl. And when it comes to car things, a man should be taking care of it. Like, that's, that's a man's job, and I was a big girl today, and I did it, but I just didn't need y'all seeing me looking stupid. So, yeah. I didn't take y'all in there because I was irritated. So I would say that my day was pretty, pretty, pretty productive got a lot done spent a lot of freaking money today but whatever i'm blessed enough to be able to do so so we're not going to complain because it's people out here that don't have the funds to do so so <sighs> it's always a positive and every negative so i'm just trying to be more optimistic about it you know yeah that's one of my goals for 2024 but this vlog is basically coming to an end um it's been a whole week since i've been filming it so it's time to just go ahead and end it and we're gonna pick up maybe tomorrow maybe i'll pick up the camera tomorrow i'm off tomorrow so i'll probably start a new vlog but i want to do like a life update and i asked my spam if y'all don't follow my spam for youtube follow it because i told y'all in the beginning of the video to follow it so go follow it it is at nyce dot well, I'm talking shit. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> okay. It's at nyce.jpg. So, go follow that because that's where I kind of, you know, connect with y'all, talk to y'all, and stuff like that. If y'all heard the rattling, that's the, door, the, the dogs. They're playing with a bone on the door. So, sorry. They're having fun. And I'm not going to stop them because this is their home. But, yeah. So, go follow me on there. But, I did oh and i asked them if i should do like a life update i don't really want to film a whole video i just think i want to have it be like a segment of the next video so i think i'm going to film a life update so if it's anything that you guys would like to know about me or anything in that nature comment down below dm me anything like that because i'm going to answer all the questions in the next video and i've been growing a lot so it's some people that's new here and they may not know things so, you know i want to catch everybody up today and even the people that has been here it's been a lot of changes so i just want to keep y'all up to date gonna do a life update and give y'all tea catch y'all up let y'all know what's been going on with your girl so yeah if y'all have anything that y'all want to know about me you know ask it i'm an open book if it's too too much, I'm just not going to answer it. But yeah, ask away. Y'all can ask me down in the comments. Y'all can DM me on the spam or my personal page. It don't matter. I don't care. Y'all can put it on my little community tab on YouTube. Wherever you want to put it, just ask the question. And I'm going to answer it. But yeah, that is pretty much it for this video, y'all. I haven't seen my man in a whole week. And I'm about to eat, shower, and go see my man. I'm about to fly. To go see my man. I miss him. And I'm about to sleep so good under my man with that little skin to skin. Mm -hmm. Yes. But <laughs> that is pretty much it for this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next video. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Let's talk about how I've been consistent. Yeah, I've been keeping up with these videos. I told you I was coming back and I'm coming back. Like, I've been video after video. 
ain't missed a week yet since I came back. So, come on now. Like, I'm back in my bag. I'm back in my YouTube bag. My content creator bag. But, yeah. I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.